I'll say it again. We need a new direction in America. It's a direction where we stand for peace. Not the kind of peace which is some airy-fairy notion, but, and not just looking at peace as the absence of war, but as peace as an active presence and capacity we have to pursue the science of human relations and to be able to use diplomacy to get to a place where we all feel secure. Well, we don't have that today. So what we do is we try to find our security through straitjacketing other nations with sanctions that inevitably are bound to fail and which ine inevitably turn the people of the countries who we're sanctioning against us and help to strengthen the hands of the regime that's being uh, sanctioned. We need to, as a nation, take a stand for nuclear abolition once and for all. We need to, as a nation, uh, get rid of this idea that war is acceptable. We need to uh, determine that we can get a strength and be a strong nation through peace. Strength through peace is the, is the approach that we ought to be taking. Have a national security strategy that involves strength through peace. And let our diplomacy, let our pursuit of diplomacy guide us in taking our relations with other nations to a new level. This isn't naive. I stood here challenging the war in Iraq, and I was right about that, and I can tell you that this Congress took a direction that wasted $5 trillion, the lives of almost 5,000 of our troops, tens of thousands of troops injured, a million Iraqis dead. Why don't we try diplomacy rather than sanctions? It's something that we really haven't tried, and it's time that we did. I uh, yield back the balance of my time. Gentlemen,